too strong versus double melee, so I go oof, so that I can abuse my passive. So when you play LC, how can I show you this? There is a trick when you get really comfortable about LC, I can show you. So, you guys probably know this, but oh, they change all of this, wow. Plus enemy, okay. So, they will burn. You see this? You see how I proc three times? So basically, when you go for denies with this, it doesn't go on cooldown on denies. So you want to aggro the creeps, and then you're gonna pr you can proc five times in a row. You proc three times and deny the creep. Did you do you understand what I did? So that's how you can get like a lot of denies on the lane as LC. That's a LC trick. Um, yeah, it's maybe too much. <laughs> yeah, I know it's known. I know it's known. You just have to think about it. That's one of the tricks I use a lot myself playing LC. And then, on the lane at least. You didn't see it? You can watch the... You can rewatch it. Um, and then, so as I told you, like LC has a new talent now, which is it increases dual range, which makes it that you can get dual without blink in fights because you use the movement speed buff from the odds to get in a better position. You have face boots also, meaning it's quite easy to get in position for a good duel, you know. And this allows you to buy items that make them makes it. It just makes it harder for them to deal with you. For instance, you know here, quite early in the game, I have Hood Vanguard, Magic Wand, plus I can also, if they don't burst me, I'm gonna, you know, dispel myself and get their HP regen. So they need to throw like a lot of spells to kill me. Bane might even sleep me, you know, like they might actually need to use most of their spells just to get rid of me. And if they don't do that, I'm gonna get like a good duel because I'm in, I'm in the brawl, you know, like I'm in the, I'm in the middle of the team fight. Instead of which I could have blink and then sure I jump and I blink and I duel somebody but then realistically what's gonna happen you know storm's gonna zip this guy's not gonna be able to connect he's far same for the supports and I'm just gonna get bursted down you know then I need BKB then I just find it much more convenient to play without blink often and you only get blink when plus you can help your team much more now I bought hood vanguard but I could complete the pipe I could buy other items to help my team and still be very effective. Uh, the build up is also nicer on the lane. You know, I get the hood early for the lane to stay and farm. And yeah, I mean, in some games you really need the blink because you need the stun, the lockdown. In this game, I have a storm. Like, he will zip in and open every fight. I don't need to have blink myself. If that makes sense. And of course, you have the shard, which makes this playstyle even better. Because the shard, you can build a lot of armor with overwhelming odds for 15 seconds, it's crazy. So I'm gonna go in the fight with like, plus 12 armor, you know, hood vanguard, like they, they can't turn on me, it's impossible. It's not worth it for them to turn on me. If they turn on me, they will just lose the fight. So that's one one way to play LC. At least that's my way. I, I, I don't like the blink stuff anymore. I used to like it, but you know, Dota changes. Hero changes. Heroes change, I mean. Alright, how's this looking?